What is going on, everybody? Shaggy Bets here with betting news. And today on this Friday, I'm here to break down three of my favorite college basketball bets on the board. We've got a big Friday slate tonight. I found three plays that I really like, and I'm here to give them to you guys right now. So without further ado, let's get right into it. Starting off with UMass Lowell traveling to Boston to take on the Boston University Terriers, and I am back in the Riverhawks. UMass Lowell minus three and a half at minus 110 on Bavada. Now laying four points on the road should probably scream it's a trap in college basketball. However, this Riverhawks team is just way too fast uh, for Boston to keep up with. Riverhawks, they rank 59th in pace. They're 100th in points per game. They shoot 48% overall, 75% from the strike. That's 57th in the nation. Now the Boston University Terriers, they are 334th in scoring, 275th in pace, 325th in field goal percentage, and 330th in free throw percentage. Their offense is just horrendous. They're nearly 100 spots behind UMass Lowell in the overall rankings. I do not see them keeping up tonight. UMass Lowell is covering the four tonight on the road. Next up, we've got another afternoon game. Grambling State going down to Gainesville to take on the Florida Gators. And I've got this one going over. Grambling in Florida, over 146.5 at minus 110 on bet online. Now, Grambling is very slow, and they really can't shoot the ball. However, Florida runs, and so I think they should push the pace, really controlling the tempo and giving Grambling some extra possessions to help contribute to this over. Grambling, they are north of 300 in lots of offensive categories, but they are 162nd in free throw percentage, so they don't leave points at the free throw line. If they can get there, they can push their total over this number. The Gators, though, they are incredibly fast. They rank 44th in pace, 23rd in scoring, and they are the number two offensive rebounding team in the nation. This could be a tough night on the glass for the Grambling State Tigers. Gators offense is much better than their defense. I don't think they need to play a lot of defense tonight. I don't think they're going to. I think this one is going to go over 146 and a half. I'm only expecting about 85, 90 points from the Gators to get us to this total. But if they have to score 100, they have to score 100. Get us over. Gators grambling over 146 and a half. And now last but not least, uh, my homerisms are coming to play a little bit. We've got Yale traveling to Lawrence to take on the Kansas Jayhawks in Allen Fieldhouse. And no, I'm not going to back the Jayhawks on the spread. I'm going to take the over. Yale and Kansas over 142 at minus 110 on Bavada. The Jayhawks, they're 100th in pace, while Yale is slower. They rank 292nd in the nation, but they both shoot the ball extremely well. The Yale Bulldogs, despite their slow pace, they are 149th in scoring. They shoot the ball 46% overall, 35% from deep, and 75% from the free throw line. That's 51st in the nation. KU, we know their offense is electric. They rank sixth in field goal percentage, making 52% of their shots, 38% from deep, and 71% from the free throw line. Yale, they do take care of the ball, so even against this Kansas defense, they are going to find a good shot each time down the floor. Um, and again, Yale's offense is still top 100 in the nation. I think KU really pushes this pace, runs this tempo up, and forces Yale to take some more shots, and trust me, they're going to knock them down, giving this total way over 142 and a half. That's what I've got for you guys today. Uh, starting off early, I've got UMass Lowell minus three and a half at minus 110 on Bavada against the Boston University Terriers. Then I've got Grambling and Florida going over 146 and a half at minus 110 on Bet Online. And last but not least, I've got Yale and KU going over 142 and a half at minus 110 on Bavada. Who doesn't like to root for points, right? Friday night, you're sitting at home. We're going to root for some points in Allen Fieldhouse. All right, people, that is all I've got for you. I hope this video was helpful. Go check us out at bettingnews.com for all of your sports betting needs. We got all kinds of offers on there as well. And follow us on Twitter at Your Betting News for more fun. Follow myself on Twitter as well at Shaggy underscore bets for all of my daily picks. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.